welcome back students upon the request of many students posting me on whatsapp as well as insta and youtube comments i am going to work out few important questions for the course principles of programming languages ppl under j and u h r e 18 regulation before that i would like to let you know the course which you have taken till now like web programming as well as web technologies by the computer science as well as information technology students most of the questions were covered from the questions which i have highlighted in the earlier video Videos. and a gentle reminder for all my viewers as well as the subscribers is that i am going to enable few more questions i mean few units important questions for the members who have taken membership in my channel my uh, dear students as i am putting lots of efforts and spending lots of time in making this questions i am going to enable only to the members few of the important questions from now and the first and foremost unit i am going to work out for you all is the three general methods of implementing a programming language operational versus denotational Ac semantics or axiomatic semantics is said to be a topmost and one shot question and the differences static versus dynamic semantic differences and the attribute grammar and its use may be a short question and also write simple assignment statements as well as attribute grammar versus ambiguous grammar and check a program whether it is an ambiguous grammar or not maybe certain programming will be given language recognizers versus generators may be also very important question the concept of orthogonality in programming language fundamental features of imperative language and the various programming domains dear students hope you are liking my videos if you haven't subscribed do subscribe to my channel i am going to work out second year as well as first year important questions as per the part a part b if you have sub please you can follow those questions and clear the courses phases of completion is said to be a short question or the long question and the gun shot question which is said to be a very important along with the flow chart factors influence the writability of a language is a very good uh, interesting question and the potential benefits of studying pl concepts may be also a long question from this part we can expect 2a to b as well as 1a dear students if you haven't taken membership on my channel please do it immediately as you are going to receive very important questions as per the jntu how operator associative can be in corporated in grammars and syntax versus semantics is said to be a topmost and one shot question for two mark d derivation part c3 related to part c2 you are supposed to write a program which is said to be two mark or the five mark and the grammars their differences and their definitions e b n f description for the c union short question language categories is a short question criteria of success for a good programming language and steps involved in it is made to be a long question this time in the question paper dear students advantages of oops and the pre and post conditions of a given statement mean in axiomatic sense semantics is said to be a topmost question which may occur in the paper either 3a as well as 3b define the term virtual machine and explain it characteristics of writability or reliability in programming language may be also a five mark question bnf and ebnf versions of an expression grammar dear students the course ppl is too lengthy and too too lengthy in its structure you are supposed to focus each and every parameter which i have highlighted as i was telling you that for the remaining units i am going to enable only to the members where they are going to showcase interest or not by following my channel i'll be coming to know by looking at the memberships define the term variable and the attributes and subtypes are versus derived types the their differences design issues for a character it is said to be a topmost question from the unit 2 i mean either 4a or 4b the design issues related to character string types or the names or specific to arrays or so on types of assignment statements is also said to be a gun shot question type of compatibility is a short question pascal versus adamian type is a short question counter control loops and the mixed mode assignment statements is also said to be a short question control structure along with an example use a define versus primitive data types array initialization is said to be a topmost question dear student the second unit is too lengthy in its structure and conditional branching problems and the statements what is the problem with a case sensitive name a short question guarded commands and the example is said to be a long question or a short question from any corner any part of the unit to you are going to get question for sure name constants associative arrays and 
structure and operations c++ pointer versus java reference variables types of union and example pointers photon 90 ada pascal and example is said to be a very important question as i was telling that the unit and the course is too lengthy too lengthy structure you are supposed to work out each and every parameter precision and arrange analyzing problems and approaches for supporting dynamic allocation and the allocation for dynamic length string is said to be a top most question arrays types and how to initialize may be a short question design issues of multiple selection constructs and the name type versus structure type compatibility and their differences how is the order of evaluation of attributes determined for the trees of a given attribute grammar dear students who have or have taken this elective subject it is bit difficult for all of you to score good marks as well as to cover this uh, topics you are supposed to work out each and every parameter which i am highlighting here binding and binding times and the examples is said to be a short question then link pointers and the last heap dynamic variable related to dynamic variable you may be getting a short question or a long question enumerated data types type checking versus i mean type checking in the static versus dynamic stack dynamic variable versus uh heap dynamic variable and the differences is said to be a top most and gun short question process of implementing printer and reference types design issues of sub programs and operations as i was told in the beginning design issues related to a question is a damn sure question static stack dynamic explicit implicit heap dynamic variables explain these terms may be short or long question these times in the paper dear students hope you are going to like my videos and subscribe to my channel as i was reminding you once again that i am going to enable third fourth and fifth unit questions only for the members from now hope you will do that and perform well in the end examination and text me if you are looking for any other course this is your chandu god signing off for today good luck and god bless you all dear students thank you